morning, everybody. Glad you've made the decision to be with us. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore, and we're glad to be bringing you action and welcoming you to the New York Arena in Midtown Manhattan for tonight's main event. Okay guys, we went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's touch gloves. Ten rounds slated in the books tonight. Here's the first. How do guys that are inside fighters tend to get themselves into trouble? Well, you watch football. You watch sometimes on the specialty teams where you're coming down to cover a punt. Well, you want to get down there. You're, you're anxious to get to that receiver real fast. And what do you do? You overshoot. You don't control yourself when you get close. Well, it's the same thing. You're an inside fighter. You're anxious to get inside. Control yourself. Don't run in so quick where you run into something or you smother yourself. Nice block by Mr. Showtime. Basic but beautiful. Jab right hand. The killer's blocking ability is doing well for him there. And Mr. Showtime stunned, and he, what a big shot. Not a good sign of the night to come. He's down here in the first round. Came out a little careless. I give him a lot of credit for even getting up from that knockdown, but he still has to impress and move forward here. Yeah, I applaud him. I give him credit, but I also recognize that he's in good shape. That's one of the reasons he got up. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. Solid shot again downstairs. And you can see he wants... Countdown, the final moments of this round. Mr. Showtime's missing the mark by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. The killer's momentum now could carry things. That was a strong round scoring that knockdown. Mr. Showtime's got to do something. This is ridiculous. He's not doing anything. What he's doing, I think, is hoping the referee's going to come in and do something for him, get him out of there. That might be what's going on. Good one, too, by Mr. Showtime. The killer's scoring with that right hand. Good looking counter punch. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Solid right hands headline that exchange. 
Took a shot, now he gives a left. The killer's movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Return to sender. He gives him back one of his own. Uh, keep you back off the ropes. Good solid shots with the combo downstairs. The killer's got a way of just getting away from that punch. Final 10 seconds of round number two. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. That was, that was fucking amazing. I want another round like that. This is your... And round number three is underway. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punching. Missed the body shot. Covers up nicely with body shot. Good return fire that time. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Halfway through this round. The killer speed to me, Ted, is clearly the biggest difference we've seen so far tonight. Yeah, but there's ways to take away speed. One is to go downstairs to the body and start to discourage the guy a little bit. Wow! He got demolished like that was a wrecking ball. One punch power ends the evening. You gotta love that. That's a big win that's going to get edged. The killer's power ends this early. Time from combination, but one shot.